few could have called the results of last night's Love Island final before they happened. But in the end, it was Ekin Su Kulkulaglu and David San Clemente who emerged victorious, beating Gemma Owen and Luca Bish in the final furlong. However, there was something missing from last night's live final, and that was the share or steal twist, which really tests if a couple is genuine or not. Each year Terry's £50,000 up for grabs, but the two winners have to pick an envelope each, with one containing £0 and the other containing the full prize. Whoever has the envelope with the prize money will be asked if they want to split it. So far, no one has chosen to keep the £50,000 for themselves. But that option was removed this year, leaving viewers scratching their heads. One popular fan theory was that producers were forced to axe it after the show took a different direction. Luca and Gemma were originally favorites to win, having fallen genuinely in love early on. However, Luca was embroiled in a bullying row over his treatment of Tasha Gori and was accused of being overprotective with Gemma. He openly criticized Tasha for pledging loyalty to Andrew LePage while getting to know several new bombshells. The fishmonger also raised eyebrows with his reaction to movie night footage of Billy Brown flirting with Gemma and stormed out and took his mic off after a row about Gemma licking Adam Collard's chest in a challenge. The public backlash was so fierce that his heartbroken family were hounded by trolls and death threats. And while all that was happening, underdogs Ekin Su and David, who have had one of the rockiest rides, continued to rise in popularity. Their journey began when Ekin Su snogged bombshell Jay Younger on the terrace while still coupled with David. Once the truth came out, he branded her a liar and actress in iconic scenes. Comparing her to food that has passed its expiry date, he vowed never to go near her again, although his resistance proved flimsy and they reunited at the next tree coupling. Casa Amor saw David snog not one, but two women in the form of Molly and Coco, while Ekin stayed loyal apart from a much-denied fumble under the sheets with George Tasker. David insisted it had been his turn to test the relationship and the pair once again got back on track, although he did once mysteriously tell her, trust is good. No trust is better. You will understand baby girl. Some viewers took that as a sign that David hadn't really forgiven her and was just planning to string her along to the final and then steal the money as revenge. What if Hess alluding to the fact that Hess gonna steal the money? Tweeted one fan. I 10,000% believe David will steal the money, added another. A third said, if David and Deccan win and David picks the money envelope him most positive he will steal the money. And a fourth agreed, anyone else think that if Ekin and David won, had steal the money for the jokes? LOL. Their claims aren't without backing, with odds from William Hill predicting that the Italian stallion is the most likely to take the money for himself at odds of 16-1. William Hill spokesperson, Tony Kinney, said, though loved up and in line to win the contest, David and Deccan Sue have proven their unpredictability time and again and could take one last chance to get one over the other by stealing the £50,000 cash prize. David has struggled to trust Deccan Sue throughout the series and is 16-1 to steal the prize. Now, Fans are convinced that producers scrapped the twist after Ekin Su and David eclipsed some of the more established couples amid real fears they might steal and undermine the authentic ethos of the show. Death threats for the most genuine contestants while they concentrate on promoting Ekin, wrote one viewer.
had to change the format at the end because she would have stole the money. Another said, they didn't put the option to share or steal BC they know Ekin and David would have chose to steal it. They not bothering with share or steal? Asked a third. Probably for the best, David can't be trusted. What do you think of last night's results? Have your say in the comments section below.